Comedy Slam on Showtime coming up. He's a very funny guy. Give it up for Mr. Justin Worsham. My favorite club. I love this place. Give a big round of applause to Richard T. Kevin. So it's good. So it's good when you come to work and you're excited. You're like, oh, it's gonna be fun. It's gonna be a good time. You know? That's gonna be awesome. We got the Unabomber in the front row. Top top. It's awesome. Congrats on getting out, man. I didn't know that you had parole. That's awesome. No, that's good. I'm gonna hang over here though. It's cool. Whatever. It's cool. Well, perfect. Put him in management. He'll be awesome. <laughs> Always love to tell you, though. You can clap for that. I'll wait. Go ahead. <laughs> they like it. I don't know what the hell your assholes are doing. Right? <laughs> I'm that. They think I'm freaking swap spots. You guys up here. You're out. You're out. Should've got into it. Do you, do you, I'll give him your address. Don't mess with me. <laughs> All he's waiting, he's like Brett Favre right now. He's just looking for a reason to get back in the game, okay? <laughs> All he needs. <laughs> Say what? 1600 Pennsylvania Avenue. Look at that guy in the front row won't laugh, but he's a political comic. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry I won't get with the yuck yucks for you, uppity mind guy. <laughs> I'll tell some fart jokes for your friends, though. You, know, <laughs> you want a fart joke? I'll give you a fart joke. Here, maybe you'll like this, too, President Guy. <laughs> you ever notice how when you're laughing at something, right, it's really funny, but then when you fart while you're laughing, instantly not funny anymore? <laughs> you know what I'm talking about? And you're always afraid that somebody hurt you, so you're like, ha, ha, ha. So I take it you're not a fan of the president that we have? No? How come? I was, I was kidding. I was joking. I don't really want to sit and talk about it. I honestly think you're the only person in the room that cares, to be honest with you. We're on the, we're on the fine. I don't know. Like, here's the thing. I'm not a very player. Wait, like, last time I checked, bottled water used to, or water used to be free, and now it costs $17 a gallon if you do the math. Nobody raised the money to that. They're like, what? No, I don't care. See, that was a hole. That was the way to go for me. <laughs> All because of this jerk off in the front row. 1600 Pennsylvania Avenue. Should've just got on board. I was killing with you. You the bomber guy, you were my friend. Oh, we were so great with you, Kaczynski. We were rocking on. <laughs> Although I look, I look closer and you look like Jerry Garcia. That's crazy. <laughs> Just got sent back to us, but not the king. What the hell? He's like, you have more work to do. There are more druggies that need populating. Go do it. We need more ice cream from Ben and Jerry. Go do it. It is my work, my will be. Where the hell am I talking about now? I'm way off track. But I'm loving it. I hope you got you having fun over here. Yeah? Gotta stay away from the front row. It's hard because I know I should move on, but it's too much to resist. Quite possibly the most masculine man in here went. Woo! I mean, seriously, I saw you beating your neck like a vampire earlier. beat me up in the parking lot. Won't be the first or the last time. Dan, please walk me in my car, Dan. Please, please. But it's not your fault. It's our fault. It's 